Well, good morning. It is Thursday, October 3rd. Brewers had a huge comeback win last night, so we've got the final game to decide if we're out or in tonight. So I'm excited. I'm also excited about this new broadhead that I got. It's called a trifecta. It is a two blade. Big cut, it's a 1.5 inch cut broadhead and I just got them. So I haven't shot them yet. This is a left bevel, so it's a single bevel. Doesn't feel all that sharp, so I'll have to sharpen them up if I decide to hunt with them. Big broadhead, big cut, two blade. Uh, I follow some people Uh, Blue Collars Outdoors on YouTube and they did a review of the smaller version of this and it just got insane penetration and insane twist in ballistics gel and I'm looking to get better penetration than I had and I thought this might do it and it's got a little bit wider cut and since it's a single blade I mean a, just a two blade I might get that deeper might get that deeper penetration. You're probably asking why didn't I have all this stuff ready before I started the video? Well, past videos like this, I've had people accuse me of taking shots with these broadheads before I start the video when I say it's first shot. So now you know this is really going to be the first shot. I just took it out of the package. I just screwed it on. And we're going to see. You're going to get to see the whole nervous first shot and everything. We're going to start close. I see I got the turkey set up there. Try shooting it into the turkey. I don't know if I'll be able to get it out of the turkey with the way that it twists. Maybe it'll go through far enough that... Uh, uh, that I'll be able to just unscrew it and back. We'll see. I'm going to shoot at the can that's hanging in front of the turkey. And this is about 18 yards here. So it's not, not that far. Let's see if this broadhead is close. <clears throat> okay. Shot high and a little bit to the left. Should shoot high because it's lighter than uh, the afflictors. I'm not sure I'm happy with how far to the left that shot though. See if I can get this out now. That's the real question. Oh yeah. Okay. All right, let's try that again. And if I get consistent hits, then maybe I'll switch the sights over. Let's go all the way back to 20 here, now that I know that I at least hit the turkey. All right, we're gonna try for the can again. I'm gonna aim at the bottom of the can. Okay, that was a little better. At least I ticked it. Still a hair to the left, but that was a lot better than that first shot. That could have just been nerves. So, okay. I'm actually pretty pleased with that shot. Now, we'll back up to 30 and see if it's just a hair to the left again. Now hopefully this won't show, shoot too much high. I 
think this will be a wicked broadhead if, uh, if I can get it to the point where I can use it. All right, here we go, 30, which is actually like 33. All right. See what happened there. I mean, I know I hit the can. Felt pretty darn good. <laughs> okay. Do I have a new broadhead that I'm going to be trying out? It looks that a ways, doesn't it? Look at that. Right through there. Ugh. Right through the cam. Holy cow. And that is a big cut. And it ruined my can there. The heck? All right, let's try one more at 20. Actually, let's try one at 15, which is, you know, the yardage that I usually shoot my deer at. Let's try one from here, 15 yards. I'm gonna shoot at the real shiny part of the bottom of the can there. I'm gonna hold just a little bit under it because we're closer, lighter. Oh no, hope that didn't break my uh, arrow. Did not break the arrow. Scrunch that up a little bit. Okay. One more at 20. Or one more at 15 here. Okay, I think this might be What I'm going to use here. I've got a few days to practice with it, so we'll practice with it, make sure that everything is good with it, and if it is, I'm definitely going to use this. Let's try this again here. Heck yeah. That is right in there. You can see that the can's so cut up that this is right through the middle or where the middle would have been. So, very happy with it. I think that's gonna be my new broadhead. For the rest of the year i think i should get better penetration with that than i did with uh afflictor so hope you're all doing good catch you guys on the next one bye